Hi, this is Mohammed. I am an Egyptian living in Germany and I'm making this video to uh, talk about my experience with Borderlinks. Borderlinks is an online shopping company, if I may say, and they give you two free mailboxes, one in the US and another one in, in the UK. And you can use these uh, mailboxes to uh, ship the items you buy online from Amazon, for example, to these mailboxes and then Borderlinks will ship the items uh, collectively to your address uh, in Egypt in my case or in Germany or to any other country. Uh, the attractive feature about Borderlinks which encouraged me to register online and use their service is that they have promised no surprises regarding the shipping costs and uh, to, to uh, facilitate this they had uh, a section on their website where you can calculate the shipping cost by uh, entering the, the weight and the dimensions of the, of the package or the item you're buying online and they, they, which country you are shipping to and they calculate the, the, the shipping cost and they calculate the taxes and everything and you have the total shipping cost and ha they have promised no surprises or at least no big surprises that was not the case with me, that was not the case. I had a very big surprise uh, when I saw the shipping cost they are asking for because it was six times the shipping cost that I have calculated using the tools on their website. And they have lectured me so many times about the volumetric weight concept, uh, which is used by air freight uh, companies. And I told them that I have used this also, I've considered this in calculating the, the shipping cost and still it is six times higher. Uh, it's six times the, the, the cost that I have calculated. And when I revised the items with one of the agents of the of Borderlinks, and this is a nice feature about Borderlinks, which is they have this live chat section. Uh, you can use it to chat with one of their agents 24 hours and they are very useful and they are very helpful and so I revised with him the, the, the shipment and the items and I discovered that one of the items is has been shipped to Borderlinks in a box that is much larger than the, the original package itself and this one is actually the one that was causing the problem so I simply asked him to remove the, the shipping box and ship the item to me in its original package or maybe in a smaller package or something to uh, save money. So he told me that Borderlinks used to provide this service before but they have changed their policies and they are not making this again or not making this anymore. So uh, is this to make more money? Uh, by shipping uh, larger items or items in, in larger boxes and make the client pay so much money in uh, shipping uh, boxes that are useless and that are going to be thrown away after all. Uh, I don't think this is logic or this is a criteria for a, a high quality service. Uh, so and for me that actually made the whole deal worthless and maybe it's a waste of money. Uh, so that's why probably uh, I would not be using uh, the service of Borderlinks anymore. And I thought of sharing this experience uh, so that it might be useful to other people that they should uh, be aware that there might be big surprises when dealing with Borderlinks. Thank you.